Step 1. Chop the ingredients. This kimchi is ripe kimchi. I chop it in advance. Slice the carrots thinly. Cut the sliced carrots into small pieces again. Chop the sliced carrots finely. Cut the ham thinly. Chop it finely. Cut the large green onion in half and chop finely. Slice the mushrooms thinly. Later, when making the sauce, I will fry and use it. Slice half of the onion thinly. All ingredients are ready. Step 2. Making the sauce. Put 1 tablespoon of oil in the pan. Put the sliced onions. Add the sliced mushrooms. Stir fry well. When the onion color becomes somewhat transparent, add a little salt and pepper. When it's all fried, transfer it to a bowl. Put 2 tablespoons of cooking oil in the pan. Add 2 tablespoons of flour. Stir fry the flour well over medium heat. When the flour color turns brown, pour 1 and a half cups of water and stir until the flour dissolves as well. When the ingredients start to boil, add 2 tablespoons of soy sauce. Add about 1 tablespoon of sugar. If you like sweetness, you can add about half a tablespoon more. Add 3 tablespoons of ketchup. Add 1 teaspoon of vinegar. Mix all the ingredients well. When the sauce starts to boil, add fried onions and mushrooms. Boil the sauce for another 5 minutes over low heat. Step 3. Stir fry the ingredients. Put about 2 tablespoons of oil in a preheated pan. Put the chopped large onion and fry it well. Add a carrots and ham as well. Fry it well. Then add a chopped kimchi as well. When the ingredients are cooked to some extent, add 1 tablespoon of soy sauce. If the kimchi is sour, add 1 teaspoon of sugar. Add 2 cups of steamed rice. When you fry the rice, do not press it with a spatula. If you stir it upright like this, the rice grains will not be crunchy and will fry it well. Finally, turn off the heat and add 1 tablespoon of sesame oil. Mix well. The yummy fried rice is ready. Step 4. Make a tornado egg. Put the heat over medium and put 1 tablespoon of oil in a preheated pan. Add a pinch of salt to the eggs and stir well. To know when the heat is ready, put a drop of egg in the pan. Once the pan is warm enough for the egg to cook right away, add a beaten egg. When air bubbles form, pull it out with chopsticks like this. And then gently rotate the chopsticks with your hands slowly. If you find it difficult to make like this, you can just cook the beaten egg and cover it with the fried rice. When the egg is properly cooked, it is done. The eggs taste better when 80% cooked as the consistency will be much softer. Let me plate it. Put the fried rice in the small bowl and press like this. And put it in a plate. Put the tornado egg you made a while ago on top of the fried rice. And pull the sauce evenly. Very delicious kimchi omelette is done.